This work is about neural combinatorial optimization, where we're trying to learn combinatorial problems in a purely data-driven manner. The motivation is to learn better heuristics for uh, potentially understudied combinatorial problems, uh, especially for those which maybe we don't have an exact solver. And this can really revolutionize such problems. Um, a good example is Google's recent TPU chip placement optimization approach, which is actually using reinforcement learning to do so. In our work, what we're trying to do is really highlight to the community this computational challenge of doing end-to-end um, -end learning for these combinatorial problems, um, especially when we tackle some large-scale problems, some realistic problems, uh, and we take the example of learning large-scale TSP. Our message is that, you know, training large-scale TSP from scratch is extremely inefficient today, and we are trying to advocate for a transfer learning approach where you learn from maybe smaller TSP and then you extrapolate to these large problems without actually um, spending the time to train on them. Uh, and what we show is that this can be potentially more powerful, but still has its limitations. So the goal of the work really is to ask questions such as which architectures, learning paradigms, and inductive biases are enabling these neural combinatorial optimization models to uh, generalize better for TSP, uh, to generalize to larger TSP instances. And uh, we hope that by asking these questions and by introducing this new challenge to the community, uh, we can push forward to the next generation of uh, such techniques and, you know, maybe start asking questions like how to build graph neural networks or transformers that are invariant to the scale of a combinatorial problem, or start thinking about more powerful search techniques which combine uh, neural networks and classical algorithms, or even think about more powerful uh, learning algorithms for uh, these techniques.